Sup diggity dogs and welcome back to the land of Dan. Da -da 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 I'm so alone. So I woke up this morning feeling like I wanted to make a difference, to do something interactive that reaches out to today's youth and makes them feel good inside. Which makes me sound like a sex predator. God damn it. It's time for a new episode of... The Internet Support Group, where I look back on my lifetime of many, many horrific mistakes to help answer your teen problems. Not today. I don't need you. <coughs> <laughs> Our first email is from Jake H12 in Ohio, who writes, Dan, I saw you tweet the other day about something called Bukake, so I googled it and now my mum has banned me from the internet, what should I do? <laughs> Oops. Susie16UK asks, Dan, I'm in love with my best friend. Here we go. We've known each other for two years and like all the same bands and TV shows and we always hang out together and he always awkwardly smiles at me, but I'm too shy to- Susie. Life is too short. Okay, here we have one from Louise, age 24, from Copenhagen. Dan, I'm feeling that my life is too safe. I don't want to be old and look back on a boring life filled with regret. So I've decided to become a nudist. Not where I thought this would be going. I find it really exciting and liberating, but I don't want people to think I'm weird. You know what, I've spent a lot of time on the internet in my time, and I've seen some pretty weird things, and that is not that weird. So you know what I say, you do what makes you happy in a designated area. I don't need getting arrested walking past a nursery. Christy, 17 from Sydney, Australia. Sorry, that was just, uh, that, that was offensive. Hi Dan, I was exhibiting my visual arts ceramics major and I've had a few comments telling me they look like vaginas. I understand flowers are supposed to be representative of female genitalia, but I had no intention of this and I can't look at my work the same. What do you think? <laughs> that, um, it... It looks like a vagina, I'm sorry. Well, if it's not intentional, maybe try to not include the, um... But hey, you know, if it makes people think your ceramics are more symbolic, keep it up. <laughs> Make dick leaves. I don't know, D don't do that. Right, this is from Stephen, 21, from Cambridge. Dan the man, yesterday my mum walked in on me sexing my girlfriend on the living room carpet and I haven't made eye contact with her in two days. What do? <laughs> oh man, oh dude, um... Well, if she didn't freak out, then I'm sure your mum appreciates the facts of life. I mean, as long as you were being safe, hey... Just try to move on, I say. Just forget about it and repress those memories deep down. Deep, deep down. Right, here is one from Sam, age 18, from Nottingham. Hey Dan, I have such a want within me to make people happy that it's actually stopping me from doing shit. I applied to uni a few weeks ago to do medicine as I feel it's the best way I can help other people. Do I really want to do this or am I just doing it because I think I should? I'm gonna be honest, Sam, having a deep down need to help others isn't the worst existential crisis I've encountered, but if I learn anything from my law experience, it's that you should enjoy what you do. I mean, medicine is a fantastic way to help others if that's what you want to do, but just make sure that it makes you happy. For to bring happiness to others, you must first bring happiness to yourself. <laughs> Mary, 17, from France. I'm considering starting YouTube videos. Is it a good idea? Yeah, of course it is. Go for it. I mean, for my social life. Oh. Gunther, 55, Germany. Dan, I've been making a shrine for you out of my own skin and I need your home address to send it. Attached is a photo of a fat naked guy on a computer. Thanks, guys, whichever one of you sent me that. And here's one from Aubrey12, USA, in brackets, don't stalk me. My best friend always hangs out with the same girl every time because she likes her better than me. I'm always excluded and feel like the third wheel. What do I do? Okay, this sucks, but I have been there. I did not have a best friend for the first 18 years of my life, and my friends always liked other people more than they liked me, and sometimes it was extremely lonely and depressing, but that is just life. I say keep hold of the friendship you have with that girl, because if you're always there for her, one day she might need you, but there are always people looking for that person they can rely on, so whether it's that girl, a new friend, or maybe even a boyfriend, one day you will find that companion. Elena, 18 from Brazil, asks, This year I haven't studied for any exams. And last year I didn't study for my exams. Do you have any technique to help me study? You're coming to me for procrastination advice. That's like asking a blind guy to pass the salt, Helena. Bit of a sensitive topic here. Okay, and Jenny, 16 from London, Dan, I need to come to you for help. I've been feeling this way for what seems like years. I used to be so happy and full of life, but something happened and all hope has drained out of me. I'm not sure if you can help me, but if you really want to know what started this, go here. 
Okay, I am so done. I... I'm, I'm done. It was a good amount. There were some good questions in there, so quit while you're ahead. That was fun. Thank you to all the people that kept randomly emailing me their problems. If you have any different advice or opinions, then please, let's have a beautiful shitstorm down in the comments. But remember, if you need help with something more serious, this is not the appropriate place for it. The most terrifying thing recently made by Dan's Followers Award goes to this morph of me and Kim Jong-un. <laughs> God is sad that that exists. And the heart crippling emotional breakdown award goes to this drawing of me and Winnie the Pooh by Becca. Uh -huh. That literally reduced me to tears, you don't understand. And on that note, I will see you guys next week. It's the Tasteful Nebula Screen. Please hit the like button if you have enjoyed this video and you can just click here if you want to subscribe to my channel to see more of my videos. It's free, but doesn't come with a free toy. What's that? You're disappointed because you didn't see me thrusting? Well, don't worry, I can show you something really naughty. I mean something goddamn disgusting that will have you feeling very bad about your behavior. Do you want to see it? Okay, well, I warned you. Yeah, that's right.